After several crashes, people living in a Williamson County neighborhood say something needs to be done to change the road and make it safer. The problem is U.S. Highway 183 and Coal Drive near Liberty Hill. KXAN's Lauren Kravitz shows us. At 70 miles per hour, it's hard to stop when you least expect it. When it hit me, it launched me in the air. And I bounced and landed against that fence. Bud Hurst suffered whiplash two years ago after a semi crashed into the trailer he was hauling behind his truck. Had the trailer not been there? It would have killed me. It would have knocked me into that oncoming truck. Hurst was stopped on US 183, trying to turn left onto Cold Drive. It's the same spot where Sherry Youngblood was hit last month. I was spun around on 183, and I could have gotten hit from oncoming traffic after these other people rear ended me. There is no turn lane on 183, and a hill makes it difficult for drivers to see stopped cars. The Texas Department of Transportation installed a flashing light a few months ago, but neighbors say it's not helping. Nobody even pays the attention to that. You know, it's just another flashing light. Neighbors want more. Just a turning lane. We could have a, a turning lane so that we could be in a safe place on the highway. Lauren Kravitz, KXAN News. TxDOT says it is waiting on funding to improve 183. The money would fund a center turn lane and shoulders along the highway from Ranch Road 1869 to the bridge. In the meantime, TxDOT says it is looking into adding a distance plaque below the existing warning sign to alert drivers that that turn is ahead.